Hi guys, welcome back to Soft Asia Tech. Today in this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can add reveal text on hover effect into your Elementor page. You can see I have added these images box and when you hover over it, it reveals some text with a see more button. I have added these three images boxes. You can also add it into your Elementor page. So for this, first you have to log into your dashboard. Now you have successfully logged into your dashboard. After logging into dashboard, you have to install a new plugin. So go to plugins and click on add new. Here in the search bar, search unlimited elements. Here at the top, you can see unlimited elements for Elementor add-on plugin. It has more than 100,000 active installations with 5 star ratings. So you can see I have already installed and activated it. So as soon as you will activate it, it will take you to its settings page. So let's go to its settings page. Here is the plugin settings page. At the top you can see the search bar. In search bar, search for hover. In the content boxes category, you can see content box hover text reveal widget. You will find a install now button over here when you install a new plugin. But I have already installed this widget. You have to click this install now button and then this widget will be installed and you can use it into your Elementor editor. So let's go to your Elementor editor and I will show you how to create this content box hover text reveal animation effect into your page. So let's go to editor. Here in the editor, I will search for hover in the widgets. As you can see the widget that I have installed now, just drag this widget into your column. Now here you have three content types. You can add image, title and the description. First of all, I will change the image here. I will select this river image and click on insert and in title I will add river. Now you can also change this description or content here but I will leave it now. You can also show or hide this learn more button but I will show this button and change the button text to see more. You can also add button link here. Here is the layout. In layout you can show this title and the text. I will enable both of them and go to style. Now here in the style, you can change this padding and alignment. I will make it center aligned. Now you can see it was center aligned now. You can change the content padding and box radius. I will add 25 pixels of box radius. Now you can see. Now you can see rounded corners around this box. Now I will go to transition. Here you have transition time. You can see when you hover over it, a cool transition and then this text will appear. So you can change its speed and time. But I will leave it to the default. Just I will go to image. Here I will change the image height. You can reduce it like that or increase it. I will make it 500. Now here you have blend mode. I will change the blend mode color and I will select this color and make it lighten. So you can see this cool filter over this image. I will change it to multiply and it will appear like that but I will select screen here. Now it looks perfect for me. I will just change the color a little bit more like that. Now I will go to overlay. Here in the overlay you can add an overlay color or image. But I will add a overlay gradient. So here you can see I have this overlay color. Now for the first color I will make it transparent. And for the second color I will make it dark black. So you can see it will appear like that. 
and here you can also change the angle like that I will leave it to 180 land color I will change land color to little bit blue so it will appear like that now after overlay settings I will go to title here in the title you can change the title color but I think default color is perfect just I will go to typography and change the font family to poppins I will increase size to 20 pixels or 25 pixels and I will give it weight of 500 pixel 500 now I will go to text here also I will leave the text color and go to typography in the typography I will change the font family to alata here I will change its size to 18 pixels and weight I will make it 400 and I will add some letter spacing I will make it 1 so it will appear like that now collapse the setting and go to button here you can change this button size color and over animation I will change the button typography and add poppins leave the size there just I will go to border radius button butter radius and I will make one so it will appear like that for the padding I will give it 20 pixels on top and right and left and for the top and bottom it will appear perfectly you can change the spacing between this text and this button so I will increase it like that now I will go back to title and increase the title size to 30 pixels so it will appear like that now I will go to general and remove the radius now I will go to column settings advanced and here I will change padding to 0 now I will duplicate this column it will appear like that I will duplicate it again now I will go to this section settings and I will change the content width from box to full width now I will go to this second column and I will change this image I will select this stream image click on insert and I will change the title to stream so it will appear like that now I will go to third one and change the image to I will select this one and click on insert and I will change the title to C now it will appear like that I am done with that so I will click on update to save the changes now to check changes how it will appear on live site I will click on this I button to preview the changes so here is your page when you hover over it you can see it has revealed your text and see more button you can see all the boxes are working perfectly that's how you can add reveal text on a hover effect into your elementor page hope you learned something new in this tutorial if so please like this video and share with your friends don't forget to subscribe our channel and also press bell icon to get notifications about future updates thanks for watching